Damn it. Damn it. Huh. What's wrong, Izzy? Uh, oh, it's you, Angel. Uh, I just can't sleep. <sighs> you get a good night's sleep around Cherry. She keeps blowing shit up. Wow, you got a lot more used to cussing throughout these past months. Yeah. She's the reason for that. Whether it's a good or bad thing, is a to the interpretation. Yeah. Well, maybe you just need a little pick-me-up. Well, you got some headache medicine. Or any kind of painkiller drug that might help. Yeah. Yeah, I got some something. I'm not taking any angel dust. Oh, no, that's my shit. You're not touching that. So, uh, but I do have something for you that will help take the edge off. What is it? Do you know what ecstasy is? Ecstasy? Uh, no. What is it? What does it do? It'll make you feel better. Really? I promise. Yeah. J here. Zuku, being the same role he is, of course he doesn't know what ecstasy is. <laughs> so he trusts Angel just wholeheartedly. As soon as he takes it, he's... Um... Huh. No, I'm not really feeling anything. Give it some time. As this slowly begins to kick in, Izuku's mind starts to go fuzzy. As the next day, he wakes up... Wait, what is this place? Are you alright? <clears throat> yeah. <sighs> You're right about that stuff. Uh, gave me the best sleep. Wait, yeah, where am I? I forgot about that. What? You're in one of Val's clubs. Oh. Why is there a pole here? What's with all this money? Yeah, this is a strip club. <laughs> what? Wait, what am I doing? Then why am I up here? Why? Wait, where? Where am I close? Why am I in a speedo? Well, um. Why does this thing fill with money? Who, who slips money in a speedo? It'll make it very uncomfortable moving. Wait, why am I even wearing one to begin with? Um, what did you do to me? You slipped some angel dust in, into that uh, ecstasy stuff, didn't you? No. And I knew some drugs affect people differently, but. I didn't expect this from you. What? Wait, what? Well, you see, why well, I said the the ecstasy would make you feel good, feel better. I wasn't lying. Oh. Oh. So it just made me feel a little loopy. That's wait. That still doesn't explain all of this. Uh, oh, hey, Val, as you look at Valentino with a broken arm, it's, get him out of here. Wait, what did I do? You broke his arm, what does it look like? I, how? How did that happen? Well, flashback. As Izuku is dancing up and down the pole, everyone throwing a surprisingly amount of money all these consider because he's, he's using his quirk he's surprisingly good at da when it comes to dancing when he's a little loose in which yeah Valentino approached him afterwards trying to offer him a job Izuku declined Valentino tried to 
use his, you know, his smoke, trying to convince him otherwise. But yeah, it didn't work with Izuku. When Valdir tried to use more forceful methods, Izuku got pissed and used Black Whip to restrain him and break his arm. All with a smile on his face. Everyone around the club is shocked, especially every Angel Dust. They don't know what to say, they don't know what to do. Yeah, Valentino, he's still holding his arm, yelling out in pain. He's like, turn the music back on. And she gets back on stage. Everyone distracted by his sheer. You can see, Izuku was much more flexible than what they would have really received. Again, my show started coming up more and more. Valentino, pissed, but on the other hand, this boy is making me a lot of money. And, yeah, they should say, allow the whammon demons and male demons alike had no problem wanting some, um, what's the best way to put this without this possibly being the monetized? Oh yeah, alone time. I think that'll work. <laughs> With Izuku, which if they ever, if they actually do break one of the number one rules, which is look and don't touch, Izuku would promptly punish them. Let's just say, at the end of the day, there were a lot more masks that left <laughs> with a smile on their face and with red asses. <laughs> Izuku cleaned house. Yeah, I mean it. He made a lot more money than Angel does sure as hell has. Which, he's actually somewhat, not jealous, but more along the lines of, wow, so this is what happens when you actually let loose. Now, flash forward. Valentino, still pissed. Izuku, hella apologetic just take your money and leave but don't I don't you get some of it no I don't, I don't want your I don't want your money that you earned I, I don't want to risk owing you anything or just ugh, I'll just charge more for admission if you ever come back and promptly leave is yeah Izuku he is feeling very bad for what he did Angel does he's gonna he's gonna kill me oh wait no no I wouldn't no no not you Val he I'm the one that brought you here oh oh yeah he may not have been able to hurt you but he sure as hell can what? As Izuku, he looks at the fear in Angel Dust's eyes. Are you okay? Does he do? Does he hurt you often? Uh, no, 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 he doesn't. Just whenever he's uh, very upset, and I did something. That is not an excuse to hurt you. Um, don't worry about it. Let's just let's just go before Cherry finds out finds out what her seeing the scene, her telling Angel to give her the details. Angel clamming up. Mm hmm. Okay, fine. Roll foot. Roll the footage. As she yeah she actually forcibly takes the security camera. And goes home to watch it. As soon as she gets back, Izuku, he's fully dressed. Angel, same. But this is. She is both pissed and proud. Pissed at Angel that's for actually giving Izuku drugs, but proud of Izuku for 
being technically able to actually let loose a little bit. They were actually commenting on certain parts of the videos. Like, you are a lot more flexible than I first thought. Her just having a devilish grin on her face. Izuku embarrassed as all hell. I, 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 this is all your fault. Pointing at Cherry, he's like, I'm not the one that drugged you. Like, no, you're the reason why I need the drugs. Excuse me. Yeah. Uh, how do you figure? Because you won't stop blowing shit up. Uh, uh, well, if, if you don't, um, if you don't like it. Maybe I can hold it, hold it, hold it, sugar tits. I got, I got a better idea. <sighs> All right. Remember that hotel I keep telling you about, yeah? Yeah, the one you told me not to go towards because of a weirdo named the Radio Demon. Yeah, why don't you just stay there for the time being? But you told me not to. I know what I said. I'm saying it's fine now. Um, are you sure? So, yeah. And technically, you are still redeemable by certain standards. You're not completely evil. You don't really have no bad tendencies, as long as you're not under the influence of anything. Um, can we just drop it? Trust me, you, you, you did a lot of dropping. <laughs> oh, don't say it like that. Well, you did. And, yeah, I'm, I'm a little jealous, but I'm, a, I'm also very impressed. Let's not stop talking about it, please. I don't know. It's going to get talked about. You, you, you really think, after all you did... No one's gonna say anything. Just go outside. I would, I promise you, people will say something. Nothing bad, definitely. If anything, a lot of people enjoyed your show. It's what you did, the vile that probably scared them, if nothing else. But still, I can't believe you actually broke his arm. Wait, so he 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 did what? Yeah. Wait, you didn't watch the whole recording to the end, did you? No. As soon as Izuku stopped dancing, that's that's pretty much when I <laughs> had to come back and tease him. But yeah, apparently I broke this guy's arm. I didn't mean to. Huh. Well, I gotta say, thanks. Huh? Oh yeah, that guy's a jerk to the angel dust. Why? So, does it happen often? Yeah, he hurts him. <coughs> huh? I mean, hurts her more times than I can count. Possibly because Angel won't tell me. Seriously, why aren't there police forces here? Mm hmm. Well, this is hell, remember? No one cares enough. Well, I care. Yeah, and that's the problem. That's what's going to get you killed. Uh, mm. Well, either way. Yeah, you can come to the hotel with me. I'm sure Charlie will love to have you. I'm pretty sure, thanks to social media, people have already been talking about you. What? Oh yeah, we have social media down here. No. Yes. And from what I see right now, you are trending. Uh, no, 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 no. Yeah, especially when it comes to what you did to Val. Oh my god. He's not down here. Trust me. You know what I meant? I did, but I just didn't care. 
as soon as Angel and Izuku head back to Hasbro Hotel, you see that yeah, it looks, it looks pretty good. But then Charlie just walks right up to him. And says, hey. So you're the one Angel's been talking about. Huh? Yeah. This weird new demon that surfaced. As then he looks at Baggy and ties, just waves and her just gives him your guy, I don't like you already. Yeah, Izuku feels that hostility. Not knowing that he's actually a J1 Lee nice guy. <laughs> he's a cinema role until I ruin him. <sighs> it's gonna be so much fun for me. <clears throat> anyway, Izuku gets checked in, and before he actually gets fully integrated, he does meet with Alistair. Like, oh, so you're human. What? No, no, no. I, I'm, I'm a demon. Really? What type? Humanoid. We have a lot of those here. Be more specific. I, uh, uh, yeah, you can't lie to save your soul. <laughs> I guess that's probably how you ended up down here. Is that a joke? Yes. Did it work? No. Well, damn. But seriously, you should try smiling more. Why? You're never fully dressed without one. I would call you sexist, but that's... Wait, is it sexist with a dude to another dude? Or is it just plain regular offensive? Eh, I never really got the issue. To me, smiling is a form of showing dominance. The first one to frown loses. Uh, why, why are you looking at me like that? I, how would you like to go back home? Very much, yes. Uh, how about we make a deal then? I can uh, help you get there. Only thing it will cost you is something you won't have to worry about until your dying day. Wait a wait a minute! No, 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 no! I am not. You're the radio demon, Alistair. Either way, yeah. Angel just warned me about you. Did he now? Huh? My friend, if you dare put your hands on me, just. Oh, right, 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 right. Wait, 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 what's that about? Oh, that's just something I call him just a gown. I mean, her nerves. Wait, so, wait. Um, yep. I just like calling Angel Dust a dude just to get on her nerves. Charlie looking. Aizuku's <laughs> confused. <laughs> For some reason, I feel like you're trying to not trying to lie to me. Well, if I was, I'd be better at it than you. Oh, that hurts. Well, I mean, hell, I won't. I, won't, I didn't get sent here all because of an accident. Well, actually, yeah, it was totally an accident, but uh, I am actually curious to how you died. I got shot. Okay, what about you, Angel? Overdose. Charlie? Uh, I was born here. What? Wait, what? Yeah, I'm just, uh, I'm just, uh, sort of the daughter of Lucifer. Uh, and what about her? I have nothing to say to you. Uh, what about um, him? Oh, who, Oscar? Yeah. None of your goddamn business. Uh, what about her? Uh, wait, who are you? 
My name's Nifty. Oh, um, hi. Hmm. Wow, you smell pretty fresh for someone who's supposed to be a demon. Are you sure you're... As he flushes his course again. <laughs> yep, I've never seen a human be able to do anything like that.